Goodbye. Well, let's remove this thing. Pretty good. A few little spots left to fix, but that's to be expected. Now into the fun one. This area here is locked. I'm going to try and carefully pry it away. I knew this would be a pain in the butt to remove. This is the shape of it. Might have to cut the um, might have to cut this part off. I don't really want to. I don't want to have to. I knew it would come off <laughs> eventually. Yeah, that was this part here was locked in. I knew it might have happened, but yeah, it is what it is. So I just cut this out, it's no big deal. Um, yeah, this came out pretty good. All those came out good. There's no real um, crazing or alligator skin or anything like that on it. It should clean up nice. And there it is. This one was a prick, which is normal. It came out good, just like the other side did. The only bit I have to fix is the boot section. It's an absolute nightmare. And now I'm going to do what I've always wanted to do ever since I got this thing. 
I'm gonna cut this off just because it annoyed me. Beautiful. You can go in the bin. Of course, I'm not going to leave it like that. Yeah. Next on the demold list is this guy. Um, I attempted to fix the first one I did with epoxy. Silly me didn't clean all the wax and PVA out of it before I put the epoxy on. And it just went nuts. So I remolded it, I put flanges underneath um, just with that clear plastic stuff and I stuck them on there with um, expanding foam, construction foam. So I've got this one all trimmed up, it should just pop straight off. <laughs> should. I gave it a light sand so I wouldn't get any splinters. This is the dash. I just gotta fix this one little bit here and this will be good to pop off. It's covering dust. Um, that was a fun job putting the uh, fiberglass on this one, I'll tell you that. So, yeah, just this one spot here. It's came, it came away on me and I didn't see it. So I just fill it up with resin. And it should be okay. Um, let, let's take this one out of the mold right now. I think I finally cracked it. Well, that was easy. <laughs> I actually ended up bending the boot lid, uh, prying it out. But you know, the surface is pretty good. All this will clean off easy. Uh, just a couple of little bits up in here I'm gonna fix. The rest of it's good. There's no air bubbles in this one. With that flange I put on it, I put the uh, the cotton flock stuff along here, and now that's solid, solid, rock solid, and super thick. So I'm just gonna fix a few little things. Yeah. It's all a part of it. But I'm happy with it. Much better than the other one. <laughs>